Hey there everyone, in this video, I'm going to utilize DeepSeek R1 to create an interactive map where we will talk about uh, top 10 countries which are, you know, world largest, okay? And let's see if DeepSeek can help us create that. And probably I would be using some kind of code. And let's see how we can set it up. And for that, let me ask DeepSeek here help me in creating an interactive world map where i will be listing or pointing top 10 countries of the world having largest area and then we can also talk about five more facts about them and we're going to use a legends markers to interact and to see the details I would like to go with basic HTML and you need to let me know what we need to do for everything. Okay, so let's see how and what it come up with. And for your information, I already have installed a VS code to my system. VS code is just like any other editor, but this is more specific to write code. So just need to visit this link and then you can download it. So after you download, you can click on Windows menu button and then you need to type code and that's how you can find it. So when you open it for the first time, you need to click on open folder and then here you need to select the folder where you would like to work with. So I'm creating here a new folder and I'm going to give it a name interactive maps and let's click on select folder. So now here you see nothing. The next thing here, what I would like to do here is I'm going to click here on terminal and let's click on new terminal. Now let's keep it aside and then here we go. Here we can see this HTML file which was, you know, being created behind us. So let me quickly copy this and what I'm going to do here is I'm going to click here on the left hand side and I'm going to create a new file and I'm going to name it as index dot html let's hit enter and then i'm gonna paste this code here so this is gonna give us complete code and now here i'm back and here it seems like we need to create some more things uh because it is saying that you know we're gonna use html and then this leaflet.js i'm gonna copy this and since i'm not aware of what actually this thing is so i'm gonna say what is this and how we need to set up and then you also didn't provide me with what name i should save the above html code but for your information i saved it as index.html and let's hit okay and now it's again thinking and probably i can stop this search extension because i just want to generate code Okay, so here seems like everything is being explained and actually I do not need to worry about this leaflet.js because it is already being added here. So all we need to do is we need to copy and we need to run it. Okay, now what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go back here and now I will click here on this extension and then I will be installing this extension known as live server okay so what this will do is this will help me to run html code so i'm gonna close this now and then here you will see this live server all we need to do is we need to hit this go live and this will open this page where i can click on these markers and can see key facts about these countries okay so here we can see Russia and then Canada. But I wanted to see the entire 10, but seems like we only have two. So all we need to do here is we need to ask again to this AI to have all the countries. And seems like, you know, initially it was only two. And with this new code, they have added all the countries. One, two, three, four, five okay still five but uh you know you know the drill right i mean let me again put it here and 
I'm gonna paste this code. Let me copy and paste new code. Again, let's press Control and S. And there we go. So now we have got these top five. And then I also would like to add or want to see the rank, okay? So now I'm gonna again ask here this DeepSeek AI. I think you only have listed five countries and then I also would like to see their rank as well. So please mention rank and try to make them more interactive or more fun. Add whatever you can, but it needs to be one of the best. Let's see now what it come up with. And there we go. Now we have got this new code and seems like we also have option to directly run the HTML here. I don't know if it was available here. Yep, it was actually. Oh, nice. So in fact, we can also directly run it here as well. So let me click here on run HTML. And there we go. It looks even more fun, guys. Now, all we need to do here is we need to copy. Let's say if we would like to run it separately. And now um, let me go here let me also open that another page which was localhost 5500 and now let me actually again paste the new code here let's click on save and now i'm gonna make it full screen and there we go guys we obviously can zoom can play with this map and then if we click on it here we can see australia its size fun fact about australia and so on similarly if i click on india here we can see fact about india and probably india is not the second most populous but the first one which we obviously can change the content here i just wanted to show you how we can create this interactive map using DeepSeek ai and guess what you do not need to be coder okay so i am also from a very different background i am from mechanicals so if i can write it you definitely can so that's all guys from my side in this video i hope that you find this video helpful informational if so then please do like and subscribe to technoholic to see more such video related to productivity and i will catch you soon with one such video related to productivity till then you take care and bye bye